everyone so today I did um, a fun fall look um, it's colorful and I really like the way it turned out it turned out much more better than I expected so if you want to see how I got it then keep watching okay so first I'm going to take a fluffy blending brush and, for, and I'm going to use my naked palette and I'm going to use the color naked that's the only color and you can buy it singly um, and I'm going to put this into my crease. Oh, and I already applied Urban Decay's Primer Potion up to my eyebrow and in my inner corner. The original one. Um, and I'm going to put that into my crease. This will just help the um, eyeshadows look a little bit more natural and blend a little better. Yeah, so, yeah. Then I'm going to take a flat shader brush. Yep, that's the one I wanted. And I'm going to take the Smashbox um, Trio in Develop. The colors are Oyster, Zoom, and Royal. Yeah, Oyster, Zoom, Royal. And I'm going to take the green Zoom on a flat shader brush. I already picked some up. And I'm just going to put that all over my eyelid. Take a little more. Okay, now that that's good, um, I'm going to take a smudge brush, yes, yeah, smudge brush, and I'm going to take this color from MAC, it's called Satin Taupe, just looks like that, and I'm just going to take a little, and put that onto my outer corner, and I don't know, it looks silly, and blend that into my crease, ta-da! Okay, and then I'm going to use a very light hand just because it's super pigmented. I'm going to take a, another fluffy blending brush, or that same one, doesn't matter. And I'm going to take the deep, like, plummy purple. Very little bit of it. You do not need a lot of this color for any of these, to be honest. And I'm just going to put that right into my crease. Okay. And now that that's done, I'm going to take, sorry, my Naked palette again. I'm going to take Half Baked, that gold, love this color so much, on a flat shader brush. It's a beautiful color. This is my, this is my like, favorite eyeshadow. And I'm going to put that like just all over my eye. Okay, and um, I just want a little more of the purple, so I'm just going to put a little more of that into the crease. Ah! Just up a little. <laughs> there. Then on an another flat shader brush, I'm going to take that Highlight Oyster from the Smashbox palette, or Trio. Put that under my eyebrow. Okay, and I'm going to take this color from MAC called Retrospec, it's a really pretty champagne color, and I'm going to take an angled brush, putting that into my inner corner, just to brighten my eyes a little bit. Um, then I'm going to take Urban Decay Liquid Eyeliner in Perversion, shake it up. And here I'm gonna Okay. Then I'm sorry that took a while. I'm gonna curl my eyelashes. And applying some Tarte Lights Camera Lashes Mascara. Sorry, I'm like 
making weird head motions. And if you want to see what I have on the rest of my face, keep okay, watching. So since I wanted like nice and pretty bronze skin, I'm going to use bronze by MAC. That's my bronzer. And I'm just going to you know, put that where you would usually apply bronzer. Okay. Then I'm going to take, for my blush, I'm going to use um, Sunset Glow by Clinique. Love Clinique blushes. Ah! I could probably only use Clinique blushes and I'd be fine. Just because, I don't know, they're just so really nice. Like, just, like they give you color, but not too much color. Oh, and I'm using an angle brush. Okay. And um, I didn't want to go, you know, too crazy and go bare, like totally bare like I usually do on my lips. Um, so I'm just going to use Cherish by MAC. It's a satin finish. It's not like a nude. But it's not like a pink. It's like a nice mix between C. It's so pretty. And it smells like brownies. Ah. And I love Max lipsticks. They last forever. Love that color too. Cherish. <laughs> um. Then for my lip gloss, I'm gonna use um Naked. Oh, by Urban Decay. Going very light. And so that's the finished look. Thanks for watching. Bye.